everyone welcome back to my channel this week um this is going to be like a shopping sort of haul from like the lead up to christmas this is all from home bargains sorry about the light the sun is just shining i can't i don't have any blinds on my bifold so i can't stop the light from shining so that's a little bit annoying uh, so everything here came to £27.25 picked up a few bits for different people and for myself as well so let's start with these uh, it's quite small it's like a little stocking basically 99p each got the pull string there got two of those for me and my partner uh, to give our gifts in these this year oh yeah 99p I thought it was really good some of this chocolate is to go in there as well. And yes, I did buy my own chocolate to go in my own stocking bag. Because my partner's no good at that sort of thing. I tend to buy all the gifts for everyone. Even for his family. That's just not what he's like. He doesn't really enjoy doing that. And I enjoy shopping. So that's fine by me. So what I really wanted to go home bargains for was a Santa play. I did want the wooden one, but I couldn't find it. The wooden, wooden one might be from last year, I'm not sure. Um, but hopefully this won't smash. As you can see, it's quite big. Got the uh, the cookies, the cup and the carrot on there. It's about the centre. Let me look at my receipt quickly. That's only one ninety nine, which I think is a really good price. So yeah, I suppose it's only about a bit smashes because it's only £2. So yeah, I'm glad I got that. Um, I also picked up, this was a present for my daughter for Christmas, for when she does painting, non-spill paint pots, pepper ones. Pack of four, £1.49, which I thought was a really good price, £1.49 for those. Some twiglets for my partner's sucking, it's a £2.25. I did get some flaming hot lentil crisps for 75p. We've had those for lunch already, so they're gone. I then got these gingerbread hearts with apricot filling. And these as well. Both for my nan's birthday. Uh, these were. These ones are 95p for £1.39. I'll also get her maybe a um, Christmas pudding and a plant as well for her birthday and a few other little bits. I then just picked up my daughter's stocking Cadbury's buttons £1.19. Some Freddos just for the cupboard £1.09 so they're cheaper than Tesco's. Cedar tape to wrap all the presents up with. I probably should have bought two of these as I own 99p. Pack of five chocolate lollies for my daughter, 99p. Um, as when we're out at the moment, it's really hard to take her shopping because she's not napping as much. Um, and when she sees things in the shop, she goes crazy and she wants everything. So I tend to give her a snack just so we can get the shop done basically. Also picked up this for her, that's for the cupboard basically. This is for her stocking. I thought it was really cute. It's 89p. I've also got the Little Tykes Bath Basketball. It's 3 99 So you can stick that on the bath and then throw the balls in it. That was really good. Then I've got the, um, where are they? Just tuber munches. She seems very small, quite light. So they're probably not that many in there. These were £1.35. That's for my partner's stocking. And then for my stocking, I got myself the Winter Wonderland Bar Cadbury's £1.19. And I love this chocolate bar. Then got a little toe brown for my partner, £1.9. And then I also got him some cool mint matchmakers for 99p but it's annoying because she scanned it twice so it actually cost me one pound 49 instead of 99p which i only just realized when i got home so i can't really go back now um and then lastly i picked up these for my stocking 
Cadbury hoods, which I really like. These were £2.19 for a pack of five. So yeah, it's like a mixture of things for my daughter, things for my nan, things for me and my partner. I don't think that was too bad actually. Yeah, it was like £27.25 all together. I picked up this for my daughter from Hobbycraft. It's a decorate your own felt tree. As you can see there. So it's quite big. Um, they had a £5 off code. So I went into the store, got £5 off and it was £7. So I only paid £2 for it, which I thought was really good. I'm not sure how long it's going to last for, but it's already got like the Velcro bit on it. I'm sure my daughter will love doing this. So yeah, that's for my hobby craft. I also picked up this Melissa and Doug sticker collection. Um, this isn't the reusable ones, it's just like normal stickers basically. And this was from a store called I think it's Beyond One or One Beyond, something like that. I uh, think it's a new store here in the UK. Um, so yeah, 500 stickers. And this cost me £2, which I wish I bought more now. And they also had like colouring ones as well. So I might go back before Christmas if I think any more. Be all these stickers. I thought it was really good for £2. I also picked up this a mini bookcase. My daughter's bedroom from Dunelm. £18. Um, it's quite small, but I think it should be fine. I think only maybe like seven or eight books can fit in there, maybe six. I'm not sure. I have to see when I build it. It would be really nice to have this in her nursery, and we can lift it up and not just carry it around and that. So all their rooms, as all her toys are in all our room, all the other rooms anyway. So I thought that'd be quite nice instead of having one attached to the um, the wall. So yeah, eighteen pound from Dunelm. Also, for Christmas, I got my daughter this um, doll's house, just from Facebook. I just need to, like, wash some of the stickers off of it and dust it a little bit. It's £15 from a Facebook. And also that lifts up as well. So, yeah, she'll love that. Just need to clean it up a bit. But, yeah, I thought it was really good for £15. Hi everyone, I thought I'd show you what I got my daughter for Christmas. She is, well she turned two in September. And so some things are like free plus, which she might like use next year. Um, everything's a mixture from new from the shops, vintage, uh, charity shops, and maybe Facebook I think, maybe. So yeah, I'll show you what I got her. Firstly, I'm going to wrap everything in this Christmas Hello Kitty paper that I got, I think, from a charity shop in January in the sale. Um, so yeah, I think she really like that because she loves Hello Kitty. So I've already wrapped some up, then I thought, oh, I better do a video, just show you what I got her. Um, but this stuff is just like the Audi toys I got her um, in the sale for like £4 each, like the wooden toys. So yeah, I picked up this game for her from a charity shop i think it was like two pound and the box is a bit damaged but that's fine but it's all in there so yeah two pound for that um where did i get this from i think it's also from a charity shop i think it was a pound reusable stickers which she loves and also good activities for her to put these on the bifold windows so she have a little chair by the window and she puts all the little reusable stickers on there they just come off quite easily here one pound for this and from vintage i saw this wooden toy so you count the numbers and then you find a little spike which has numbers on and you place it in the right place so i think when she's a little bit older maybe next year she'll be into this and putting the spikes on uh, I think that was about £5, including postage. I then got this little fishing game, which is from Flying... What's it from? Flying Tiger. Uh, the lid sort of like doesn't fit on properly, which is a little bit annoying, but that's fine. Um, but yeah, it's just fishing with the little magnets. So she can buy one out. 
see how pretty it's a cure. Uh, this came in like a bundle of other toys. Uh, but I think on its own, I think it was like just a pound on its own. Also from the same bundle, I picked up what was my name on it. This um, it's nursery rhyme book, but it's got all the all characters. We've got the black sheep, a mouse, Humpty Dumpty, <laughs> spider. the star and the fish they're quite cute they're all like finger puppets and then we got the nursery rhyme book uh, this was i think two pound fifty from the same lady on vinted um these are 30 pound on amazon so yeah i quickly put this in my basket on vinted because i love so i knew they're quite expensive anyway so yeah you can do the nursery rhymes with the puppets which i think is great Obviously, my daughter's, you know, she is too. She still loves the nursery rhymes. And she always sings, um, always sings them in the car when we're out. So, yeah, she'll love these. I then picked these up from Argos the other day. These were two for £15. And they're the Chad Valley brand. They are a lot smaller than I thought they were going to be, like, box-wise. Um, but I actually showed my daughter the Argos website and she picked these out that she wanted and she really wanted the birthday cake. So I got her these, not too expensive, kind of like the same price as like the Aldi and Little Toys. Um, so yeah, she'll love cutting these up with the knife. And also at the moment she's obsessed with happy birthday. We've had a lot of birthdays in the family and she just sings it all the time randomly. <laughs> so yeah, she'll love a cake and she also pretends to blow up the cake as well, though she hasn't got a cake. <laughs> but now she does. So yeah. Two of those from Argos. I think on office at the moment, two for £15. And there's a few other ones to pick from as well. I also picked her up this Coco Melon Jigsaw Puzzle in the charity shop for £1. Uh, it's quite an easy one for her to start with because it's only like three pieces. It's quite easy for her to do. I then picked up some Play-Doh as well at the charity shop. This was I think £2 or £3. Um, hopefully they're not dried up or anything like that. But we'll find out. And then I've got this. The other day from Aldi, it's the last one left. It was one ninety nine in the sale. Uh, you spin the wheel, which is quite hard to spin actually, and then you find the number and then you pop it on uh, the wooden thing here to make the butterfly. And um, so you just slot it in. I thought it would be quite good for her to do. And then also from a charity shop, this was two pound. Just need to set the tape up a bit, a little bit. A uh, wooden memory game. Hey Dougie, this would be really nice for her, she loves Hey Dougie. Um, also, I think I've already shown this before, this one from Home Bargains, it was like 3 99 The Bath. Um, also from a charity shop, I've got her this, which is so cute, little reindeer. Um, is it a squish nose? Yeah. But yeah, this was £2 and yeah, I've just had to get it for her there was a little stain on it but i've managed to wash it off but yeah i might even keep this for myself it's really cute um i also got her loads of christmas books from like home bargains charity shops some chocolate treats like chocolate lollies chocolate buttons to go in her stocking and the books i'm going to give her in december because i like to put christmas books back in the attic so i've given to her on christmas day they're going back you know new year's eve in the attic so she won't really get a chance to read them. So they're coming out in December. She's also got a chocolate advent calendar. Just a Cadbury's one. And a, a Disney calendar from her grandparents. With like all the books in. So we can read her book every night before bed. So yeah that's everything that I got my daughter for Christmas. 
If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. And I'll see you in my next one. Thank you for watching.